For some unlucky travelers, the problems aren't ending when their flight touches down. Baggage claim looking more like a free for all. Those leaving without their luggage looking for anything in the way of answers. CTV's Janice Golding reports. This is the baggage waiting area at Terminal 1. Do I know for sure that the bag's here? It didn't go to Montreal or anything, did it? Full of weary, frustrated passengers. It's just chaos. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Searching in many cases fruitlessly for their luggage. Yesterday, six hours here. Nobody answered nothing, nothing. It's incredible. They lost um, nine of our bags that actually the, they went to uh, Amsterdam without us. That's where we should be right now. We were here for like maybe four hours and then we got a hotel and we came back this morning. Air Canada calls many of the baggage issues outside the airline's control, saying the operating environment has changed since the pandemic. It adds the resumption of travel has posed challenges for the industry. We now carry about 120,000 or more people a day versus 23,000 a year ago. According to the Greater Toronto Airports Authority, flight delays and cancellations, along with staffing shortages with airline partners, as well as temporary mechanical issues with the baggage system itself, are causing the delays. The federal transport minister says the government has added staff to CATSA and CBSA and adjusted public health measures that may have been adding to bottlenecks. And yet... We continue to see delays, cancellations and luggage issues. So um, our commitment is to continue to work with airlines uh, to address these issues. I've had conversations with the four largest airports and the two largest airlines just on Thursday, and I will be having follow-up conversations with them soon. And nobody answer about my baggage. But customers say this suitcase scavenger hunt is unacceptable. I'm full out stressed. There's some things in there that I need to be able to do some other work, and I can't. So I'm, I'm actually freaking out. And losing their luggage is causing many to lose their tempers. Janice Golding, CTV News.